On either side the river lie, Long the fields of glory and of rye. Cut for the wall and meet the sky, And throw the field the road runs by. To money tower Camelot, The yellow-leaved water lily, The green sheep daffodil, Tremble in the water chilly. Round about Shalott, Willows white and aspen shiver, The sunbeam showers break and quiver, In the stream that runneth ever, By the island in the river, Flowing down to Camelot. Four grey walls and four grey towers Overlook the space of flowers, And the silent island bores The Lady of Shalott. Underneath the bearded barley, the reaper reaping late and early, hears her ever chanting cheerily, like an angel singing clearly, o'er the stream of Camelot. Piling the sheaves in furrows airy, beneath the moon, the reaper weary, listening whispers, tis the fairy, Lady of Shalott. No time hath she to sport to play, a charmed web she weaves alway, a curse is on her if she stay, her weaving either night or day to look down to Camelot. She knows not what the curse may be, therefore she weaveth steadily, therefore no other care hath she the lady of Shalott. She lives with little joy or fear, over the water running near, the sheep bell tinkles in her ear, before her hangs a mirror clear, reflecting towered Camelot. And sometimes through the mirror blue, the knights come riding two and two, she hath no loyal knight and true, the Lady of Shalott. A bow shot from her bower reeves, he rode between the barley sheaves, the sun came dazzling through and land upon the brazen reeves of old Sir Lancelot. A red cross knight forever kneels to a lady in his shield. His spot pulled on the yellow field beside remote Shalott. His broad clear brow in sunlight glowed on burnished hoofs his war horse trode from underneath his helmet flowed. His coal black curls as on he rode as he rode down Camelot. From the bank and from the river, he flashed into the crystal mirror. Tira lira, tira lira, sang Sir Lancelot. She left the web, she left the loom. She made three paces through the room. She saw the water flower bloom. She saw the helmet and the bloom. She looked down to Camelot. Out flew the web and floated wide. The mirror cracked from side to side. The curses come upon me, cry the Lady of Shalott. In the stormy east wind straining, the pale yellow woods were waning. The broad stream in his banks complaining, heavily the low sky raining. Over towered Camelot, outside thy the shallow boat. Beneath a willow lay afloat, below the carven stern she wrote, the Lady of Shalott. With a steady stony glance, like some old seer in a trance, beholding all his own miscants, mute with a glassy countenance. She looked down to Camelot, it was the closing of the day. She loosed the chain and down she lay. The broad street bore her far away, the Lady of Shalott. A long drawn carol mournful, holy. She chanted loudly, chanted lowly, till her eyes were dark and holy. Towered Camelot, for as she reached upon the tide, the first house by the waterside, singing in her song. On 
the tower and balcony By garden wall and gallery A pale, pale corpse she floated by Dead cold between the houses high Dead into towered Camelot Knight and burger, lord and dame To the plant wharf each came Below the stern they read her name The Lady of Shalott The Lady of Shalott 